What's up, guys and gals, boys and girls? It's Garrett, Gilbert's Pad. I uh, just want to make a quick video, just kind of showing some of my most recent customs I've done. Just a small group of them for you. First off, I'll check out this little Volkswagen Beetle. Did a custom uh, custom motor there, hand fabricated piping and all that. Air cleaner on there. It's actually got a carburetor on there too. You can kind of see it there, gold. Cut out the back section there. Put in that motor. Give it a nice bright orange paint job. Some decals on the side. There she goes. And next up, we'll check out this. The Rowdy Rodder. And this one is a matchbox. As you can see, I have a little touch up to do. Totally forgot about that till right now. I'll fix that. <laughs> but. It's got a big old motor in the back. Slam down in the front. Got some slicks in the back. Your muscle. You guys know me, I'm all about the muscle cars. So that is that one. And yes, it rolls too. And then we got this Monte Carlo. Let's see if we can pick up the color better. Uh, kind of see. Got a really metallic, uh, metallic gold paint. My lighting is always terrible in here, I'm sorry. Got the BFGs. Yeah, cut the hood off. Of course, got a big old giant motor. So you know me. Put a custom firewall in there. Put a Chevy logo on it. Let's see if we can pick this up. Put goob right there. Because why not? So there's that guy. Then we got this Silverado single cap. Come on, focus. There we go. As you all know, this one comes as a extended cab. Chopped it down, shortened up everything, made it into the single cab. Give it a nice pretty blue paint job. Some big old rail riders. Lots of details. Got the clear coat. It's nice and shiny. A lot of these actually look way better outside in the natural light and sunlight too. But there's that one. You can see the base was cut and molded back together there. Right now we got a Roger Dodger made into a gasser and for whatever reason this color comes out I don't even know more bluish in the video but it's actually more of a green in person let's see if we can can't really get the color but Anyway, made this one into a gasser. Got that race.
chasing decals on there. Interiors detailed, you can kind of see in there a little bit. If you look close, you can see the racing harnesses and stuff. So, yeah, there's a gasser. Um, let's see, then there's a couple just quick little, little repaints basically. These ones are getting sent off as a part of a trade on Instagram. And I think she's going to be happy with them. Got the purple and the pink. Got to be a Hemi, of course. So yeah, I just gave this one the pink paint job. Real Riders. Some basic details. And then the square back. It's got a really pretty purple paint job. It's actually a, a metal cast paint right over the bare metal. Just polished up the metal a little bit. Got the Steely Real Riders in the back. Got a little peace, love, and happiness kind of theme there. Just nice, pretty purple. Really love that one. And. Then we got a couple gassers, because I love gassers. And let's start out with the candy striper. This is a custom candy striper. Just finished this one tonight. And it's obviously not a spectra flame purple, but or pink I should say. But it's a nice bright pink on it. All detail all around. Got all the candy striper decals. Complete with the Hoosier tires even. Gave it some blue windows. I think it came out pretty good for, for what it is. Being a, basically a clone. And finally, we have this gasser, which is probably one of my favorite builds I've made so far. And this one's pretty cool. Got it the uh, the matte black paint job with a primered front end. Basically, like they just threw a fiberglass front end on it. Got some racing decals on it. Got the Mickey Thompson slicks in the back. Little chrome pizza cutters up front. Got some decals in the window, some racing stickers. Little Hemi on the plate on the back because we've got a big old Hemi in it. Let's see if I can get this on the video. So you can see I added the uh, red tip injection there, the hillboard, and you can kind of see that I have the spark plug wires in there too. There we go. And I made a custom distributor right up in front here. So it's got that Hemi. The wires coming out to both sides.
put the yellow windows in it. So that's pretty much it for right now. Hope you guys like my video. Just wanted to show off a little bit of what I do. Be sure to comment and let me know what you guys think. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. And if you think it sucks, give it a thumbs down. But we'll hope for the thumbs up. <laughs> so until next time. Have fun, my friends. Peace.